Hello everybody, welcome back to probably the last episode on this server. Uh, Minecraft <laughs> Season 4 is coming to an end. And uh, oh man, people have been griefing. <laughs> uh, it's time to, to do one last tour of my places. Uh, I decided not to do that in the big tour we did with all the guys. Um, just so I can go through it all more detail and stuff and, and uh, just, you know all that jazz. So, there used to be a theater here. It's not there anymore. So sad. I was wanting to rebuild it, but uh, I didn't have the time for it. I wanted to do it with Aurelian too, and she's in America, she's traveling a lot, and she usually has uh, more free time when it's nighttime for her, which means 4 a.m. for me, so it was a bit uh, hard to um, find the right time, and we didn't, we, did, we weren't able to find the right time to collaborate uh, in, in, in this short time span. But anyway, this is where it all started, spawn town for me. Oh god. Uh, I did move out pretty quick though. Um, but I want to start here with these builds. That would just before we go to Arkadam and all that places. <laughs> so, this is one of the later builds I did. The Balak Exchange. Uh, kind of Greek slash Roman. Uh, Roman. I think that's right. Uh, inspired building. It's got like the little. Uh, like the, the soft angled roof, kinda. It's got a second thing on top. It's it's really pretty. They did a pretty good video about it. I think it was episode 40. Uh, go check it out. <laughs> um, but yeah, I was pretty happy with it. Um, I'm still happy with it. And it's it's one of my better builds on the server. Um, however, uh, the color scheme is a bit pinky reddish on the inside. I'm not sure if I still like that too much uh, nowadays. But. Anyway, I did make some money in this place, and I'm happy about that. Um, so there you go. I was going to do more builds here, but it was kind of... I was a bit uninspired to do so. There used to be pretty trees here, and then Vex cut them all down! Um, <laughs> uh, angry neighbor. Uh, but yeah, I was, was wanting to, to extend this here, and... Who are you? I don't know who you are. I'm going to go that way. Uh, but it never really happened. But... Yeah, anyway, uh, next season I've, I'm, I'm planning to do things a lot more professional <laughs> in where I will only start a new project if I finish one which also means I'll probably do a, a bit more smaller projects um, I have I have plans for, for big projects, like really big builds and stuff instead of making them on this map, I'm probably gonna do some more creative in the future uh, or very soon in the future <laughs> uh, which involves Cool things. I won't say too much though, but it's gonna involve you guys a lot more. Uh, so there you go. Let's steal this horse. I'm a thief now. Whatever. Apocalypse, apocalypse is coming to the server anyway, so there you go. Uh, I think that's all I did in spawn. Um, can't think of much else. Here we have Aurelian's thing. I did, I did clear out the whole mountain with her. Um, I, this is my beacon here. Uh, she was doing it with iron tools during a live stream, and I was live streaming too, and it was a pain to watch, and basically I helped her with the beacon, it was great. Uh, good times, good times. Anyway, let's uh, let's follow this path here, well, path. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm a bit sad that I didn't uh, finish the, oh god, sorry horsey, I didn't finish the road. Uh, it was a really big project though, and it was a, a very big grind, and it was... It was a bit hard to finish with like the reset uh, coming up shortly. Uh, but it was a project that I started a long, long time ago. Should have finished earlier. Um, just, just keep on going it. A bit more motivated I should have been. <laughs> but these are all lessons for life. Um, so I'm, I'm, I'm at least taking that with me. <laughs> uh, this video is going to be so sad. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoy Oh my god, I'm such a bad uh, driver. Uh, let's go to another pretty, pretty, pretty new build, kinda. Um, it also didn't finish. <laughs> uh, let's uh, please ignore the fact that most of these builds aren't really finished. Please, I'd appreciate that. Um, but it's 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 close to finished. I mean, like most of them are kind of finished, like on their own. Just not the whole thing. And I, I always have like a, a very big perspective, like or a big plan. For my build, so I guess you have to take that in account too. 
that I really, really want to do things big. Uh, but this is the build here. I guess it's pretty, pretty finished to be honest. Except for this building. This is a, this is an abandoned building. Yep, yeah, yeah, abandoned. Um, but all the other buildings are pretty, pretty much finished. And what I wanted to do is add some bigger trees, like a few more of those, uh, and maybe a sheep pen somewhere, and maybe eventually uh, like a mine down here. But I never started them, so. It's not really unfinished. So this is a finished build. <laughs> Suck it, guys. <laughs> uh, but here we have. We can. I can demonstrate. Here we have. Uh, oh god! You're. Oh god! You're a turbo horse. This is a horse pan, uh, which works 100%. Uh, I keep my donkeys and horses in here. I never had a horse. I only had donkeys. Donkeys are great. Uh, but here we have like. Um, Oh god, oh god, oh jesus. Here we have a building shack, house, my house I guess. Uh, got stuff here, lots of resources and supplies. Let me get some in the balls. While I'm at here. So that's cool. Um, this here is the drunken dwarf inn. It's an inn I built. Um, this project was heavily based, because I really wanted to do a very uh, to, to to experiment a bit more, more with like interior design, so I have not much experience with that. So here you go. Um, I'll be doing a lot more interior design next season too. Um, so yeah, <laughs> I'm excited. But this is a cool bar. I like it. It's great. I get drunk there every night. <laughs> First, really, that's cool. All right, horsey, come on. Let's continue onward with the tour. Uh, here is the road, by the way. It kind of stops here, <laughs> um, but yeah, it's a. This, this is a lot of work. This road. Look at all the blocks I had to place, and all the things I had to dig, and I have to, you know, make sure every edge is right and correct and pretty. And yeah, uh, we came close though. I think I think we were past 50% of completion of the road. Uh, so that's pretty cool. Okay, horsey. Oh, you suck so bad. Yeah, take the time. You deserve that. <laughs> oh, I'm terrible. Okay, horsey, come on, horsey. I don't know who I don't know who your owner was, but he or she probably he didn't didn't. Oh god, didn't do a good job of teaching you how to swim or stand on ice. Jesus Christ! Is that just? Am I tripping? Horse, what are what in or? Oh Jesus Christ! Oh man, I hate you so much right now, horse. Oh. <laughs> mm. uh, I hope you, I hope you like the purgatory of, of, of server stopping. You will soon get. <laughs> oh God! Here's the continuation of the road. Uh, this goes to Pyros, uh, Lapis Castle. Not really connected. Uh, wanted to do that and come around to that and this here is the road oh there are some things here uh, this part is pretty recent and I'm pretty pretty happy with this part so this part just goes around here down through the jungle uh, this place needs a bit more overgrownness to it uh, but it goes here through the jungle I hate vines <laughs> I really like this bridge and this view, it's great, I love it. Uh, over this bridge. Uh, down this place. See, so yeah, I just build, I don't know, like. It, it, it's, it's not like you build like a big structure of this road, but it's it's more of a. It's like it's like a journey. <laughs> or an attraction or something. But I what, what I wanted originally for this road is I didn't want a nether portal. I wanted people to always come here with horses or donkeys um, and give them a nice journey along the way and I think I did a pretty good job of that. Uh, here's, here's th These are the lands of Arcadia by the way, I think beyond that bridge there, this is all Arcadia. Uh, here we have the farmhouse and uh, a building of the citizens of Arcadia, which mostly consists of sheep. <laughs> Let's go to the farm. Um, yeah, I like the road. <laughs> So this farm, I, I, I did a few, couple of videos about this farm. 
uh, is when I started messing about with this texture like a uh, light gray stained clay with <laughs> clay bricks uh, and I used it a lot more in my, in my, my, my projects and builds because I really like the texture uh, and to build a windmill because I always wanted to build a windmill here you go this is an Arcus windmill uh, inspired by the Dutch windmills by the way and yeah more organic um, sheep pens which kind of look a bit weird on the angled parts because of how Minecraft works, but I think it looks pretty neat. Um, you can go around here, it's a little pen for horses and donkeys. Let's use it. Uh, which fields? Badge will be, will be very <laughs> appreciated of this. Oh god, words. This is going to be storage. I need to farm a bunch more of wheat to do that though, but this is, I, I like this for you. This is great. There's some carrots and some potatoes too. So overall, a pretty cool farm, I would say. Oh god, this is what it used to be. Did I never replace this? Man. Yeah, I, I did this before, and then I like this texture a lot better. This is a lot cooler. This is a more warm texture. Um, and this is all a cool place, so there you go. This is the farmhouse. It's a farm house. <laughs> it's got paintings. It's got arrows. It's got little weeds. It's got some bunch more crap. It's got bread. It's a farmhouse. Uh, this is a bedroom here. Did I seriously place this here? Did someone prank me? Get that shit out of here. <laughs> God. <laughs> Gross. Alright, so. Let's continue. For some reason, I feel like you're like Dark Source or something. It's a German. I don't know. Um, I think I also experimented with these. Yeah, I did. Uh, so what what I did here is I experimented a bit more with um with lightning because she had these because uh, what I wanted to do to have is like lanterns, but then more functional like they actually light up a large portion of the area, and with torches you can't really do that on top there because they they won't they won't light up a whole place. So to simulate that I. It, this stuff here, which I didn't really like, to be honest, so I, I didn't really do it. Um, but yeah, there you go. This is where it stops. <laughs> you have to go up here. And you can't with the horse. Oh god, the vines, I hate them so much. Ooh. So you go to straight here. Oh, don't, don't get in the pool. Uh, I was a bit... There were, uh, like, I had some... Problems figuring out what to do here with the city. Uh, it was a massive project anyway. But here is Arcus Dam. Yay! This is the city that I love. It's like Gotham City, like that song from R. Kelly. But then Arcus Dam is great. I added some leaves lately. It's great. I, lo I love them. Uh, very nice addition. Uh, inspired by Beetle Below. And I think he got it from Karatus or Gliss. I don't know. But yeah. Leaves. They are great. Um, so Arcus Dam. Supposed to be like an old, built on the jungle slash overgrown city. Uh, horsey, you can just wander about here. I don't care about you anymore. <laughs> uh, and I, I pretty much like it. Uh, I was gonna do a lot. Uh, like I had, I had a grand vision for this place, and I think oh, there's a secret button here. Like this interior zone, I didn't do a whole bunch of interiors, but this is my like. Uh, laboratory. If we go up here, we have like the potions and stuff. It's great. I don't think it goes up much. Oh, well, I don't think there is much up higher. Oh, there it is. Oh, there you go. It's like a little uh, laboratory. Much gray. A little blue for nice contrast here. Soft colors though. Soft colors. <laughs> uh, but here you go. It's an empty room here. How much did I finish with this place? Not a whole bunch. I was replacing uh, the wood here with. This clay. This is when I started using more clay instead of stone in the builds here uh, to get some more color. Prior to adding the leaves, though. So there you go. I was I was in the process of finishing this too, man. <laughs> oh well. Uh, but anyway, like after a little while, I felt a bit uninspired for the city as well. <sighs> Inspiration hard to get. Um, but seriously, for next season, I'm very very set on finishing things a lot more because it is worth the effort like what you what you get in return so there you go 
there you go. This is the laboratory. Uh, let's not wander too long about the city. Uh, these trees are made by Beta Below. I hired him as a, uh, as a, as a tree guy. Uh, here's the ocean. Bloop, 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 bloop. Core tower, not much special here. Uh, and I've really connected this here. It looks a bit messy. Didn't really finish the interior here too. I used a, little, uh, I used a lot of jungle wood in here, uh, in the whole city, because I had a lot, like, a ton of it. Because of, um, uh, because I had to chop down a whole bunch of trees too. So there you go. Um, I think lately, like, this is even newer. Like, I did this here. Ah, oh, I really like this. Oh. <laughs> so there you go. I think, overall, this is a pretty cool build anyway. Even though it's not finished, it's more like ruined or almost, I guess. Uh, so, I guess, I guess it needs a bit more adjustments, a bit more professional, professionally ruined. But I feel that it looks pretty cool, you know, nonetheless, so far. There are some buildings here. This is the apartment complex, which I... This was one of my first ground builds here. Uh, it's gonna be like a little hotel, and people could, like, rent a room here. This was Beta Below's room when he, he, he got here to, to build the trees, you know. Got to give the builder some... Accommodation while he do, does his job, so there you go. I was gonna do like mailboxes here for all the rooms you like you see in real life. It's gonna be cool. The tree in the middle here, you can kind of like get a peek of the, uh, the, the, the the landscape below. This is natural landscape, didn't touch it, I think. I'm not sure, I might have lied in the past about it, but there you go. Uh, and basically, like the city, I really like the level design, I like different pathways and different height levels and not just a free like, like a 2d landscape but more like 3d so more in, in, in the height in the air and stuff and pathways along the sides of buildings and stuff that's what I really wanted to do with this build I think I can kinda achieve that here another be the blow tree right there it's a building there uh, this goes up here doop, 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 doop. Uh, but I recently I think one of my, my the last things I did was a lot of work on this tower here, trying to get that to a point where it's kind of cool. Uh, this is my piston elevator with slime blocks, which doesn't work half the time. Ah, lovely, kind of. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I didn't really finish this one either. <laughs> but it's cool nonetheless. Um, you can look into the building there, it's not finished either. The tower is kind of finished though, kind of. Happy about that. Uh, it's actually Pearl out of here. But yeah, this is Arcus Den, my biggest project here on the server. Happy with it. How it, how far it came. Um, I really wanted to do PvP here with the guys, and we did at some point, which was great. Wasn't totally finished though, but this is this is a a, a big project. I should have, like, uh, I should have like finished things a lot more when I was actually working on them. Oh, hey guy. Because uh, when you leave something and don't touch it for a long time, you're just not going to touch it anymore. So that's it's kind of bad. <sighs> but oh well. Oh, I think I did that there too. Hold on, let me go there real quick. Uh, so these are sheep. Um, and the sheep pen here. I was making a sheep from here. It was, it was looking cool. And uh, this basically goes up to the tower again. Well, crap. I didn't finish this. <laughs> Dang it, Arcus. Dang it. Um, but yeah, that's about Arcus Dam here. It's not nothing too much to to show here. Uh, let's go to the Nether, and I want to visit the project I haven't visited in a long time. <laughs> the desert base, which I never really finished either. Man, I'm terrible. Oh well. Um, and a lot of people, a lot of people, they they say that because of the reset, all the builds aren't gonna get finished. But I disagree on that, because I think it's like, at least for me, um, the build that I didn't finish, even though if the server would run for another year, I'm not sure if I would have finished them by then, either. Uh, just because of, of the way I, how, I do, how I do things. Um, so, don't blame it on the server reset, blame it on me. <laughs> blame it on me. Uh, but yeah, this is, this is my nether tunnel. I really like it. Didn't finish it. <laughs> I'm a terrible person. Uh, but I really, really, really do plan on finishing things a lot more. Uh, I really want to t 
take this on a lot more professional, professionally. So, there you go. There you go. I did make mistakes this season, but it's all a learning phase, I guess. I don't know. Uh, I think we have to take uh, Nebris' tunnel, and I think it's a pretty long ride. Um, but we're gonna do it. And we're gonna do it good. And I will see you guys over there. Alright guys, before we leave the uh, the Arcus Dam area, I wanted to show off uh, one more build <laughs> I started. Uh, this is my Skyrim inspired build. Um, after I started, after I did that uh, Vineyard Beef prank with the, the little dungeon I made, uh, this is also something I started. Skyrim inspired. Didn't finish it, of course. However, I think the fault over this problem, like, I only thought of like the front. But I didn't plan the whole project out, so I came to this point and I was like, oh, what do I do now? Also, I died and lost all the stuff I harvested from miles away, so... Like, all these blocks and stuff, I harvested from, like, thousands of blocks away, because we had to get into, like, new terrain. So I lost most of them. I got a few here, though. Oh, 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 oh got some. <laughs> it's not a good excuse, okay. Um, but yeah, that was, that was kind of sad. But this was my going to be my snow farm. Didn't finish it. Let's move on. All right, everybody. Steve here. I'm gonna do a quick tour of my other big project. We're in another here. It's dark. Uh, there's no official way here, but this is my desert base, which I started, which I liked. Uh, this is like a little building shack here. Orcs is desert base. But bam. Uh, <laughs> it has birch trees. Oh god. So here we go. Uh, this is the outside bit I did on this, um, like a little rune thing. Uh, there was the idea to have like some kind of uh, desert temple sandstone ruins on top, and a cool base on the ground. This is for my cameraman, cameraman, <laughs> not man, man. And uh, here's the entrance. So here we go. Um, wasn't 100% finished yet, but let's go down here. Here is the Thing. So this was a bit experimental, uh, trying to do something different, which we're not very familiar with, uh, using all these blocks you can see here, liking it. Um, here's my face, identifying that this is my build, uh, I love it. <laughs> it has some quarters here, this is really cool, oh, this isn't, okay, oops, <laughs> but you press this button here, there you go. Storage. Oh man, my, oh, I'm rich. <laughs> There's a lot of stuff here. Look at all that stone, baby. Mm -mm. Um, yeah, cool materials. Basically, just oh, there's a creeper there. Uh, basically, just just doing something different here with endstone and and, and nether brick. I think this is a nice contrast to it. And somebody on the Reddit, like I wanted to have like a glass floor. And someone on the Reddit made like a mirror floor of it, so that was my idea, uh, which was what I was gonna try to do. It was gonna be a lot of work, cause I basically have to make the same room twice. Uh, but I have all this here, but then mirrored. You have this mirror effect. That'd be really cool. Uh, I might still do it in the next map. Who knows? It's really cool. Uh, but yeah, let's, let's go further into this. Into the, 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 blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Words. <laughs> Let's go further into the depths. A uh, hard word. Uh, this is gonna be like a little crafting area with like some furnaces at places and stuff. Um, if you go down here, I did finish this though. Nice hallway. Uh, I was gonna do some cool designs here down below, so you have like nice views. This goes down here too. I don't think this goes anywhere here. I use fences as you can see to get the um, correct height for these blocks, because if you don't have fences under these, you'll be a bit lower than these half slab and you get dizzy, <laughs> I imagine. I don't know. Uh, so over here, if we go down here, I was going to put a beacon in here. Um, this is the sheep farm. Uh, this is a cool floor. I like this floor. It's great. So we have these sheep pens, and I was going to make uh, 16 of them for every color. Then got around to finish it. It was getting a bit massive because of the scale of it. Uh, I was gonna have uh, retracting doors here for every pen. So what I wanted was to have like uh, 
hallways which were like closed off basically a hallway here and you have to find a lever and these things would open otherwise it would just look like a little dent in the wall uh, and the doors would open and stuff and this would go around here we have the same thing here um, however <laughs> oh god I had to dig out a whole bunch more Let's see, there are 16, these are 4, plus 4 is 8, plus 4 in the back there, which would be 12. So I had to dig out a little bit more uh, to finish this, but it was getting a lot of work. I was touching the surface here too, and oh god, <laughs> this, this project, man, this, this has gone a bit big. Uh, I think this one works. I made a door here. It was great. I loved it. Uh, where's the lever? Is there no lever here? It's on the inside, maybe. Man, this is stupid. Wait, wait. I've got a door with no lever. Hold on, mate. Hold on. Is there... There has to be... A way to open. <laughs> Close. Right? Hold on, where, where's the input? Is, is it this here? Hold on, I... Mm. I, uh, I can't, I can't find it, the, the, what? I'm sure there's a lever somewhere and I missed it. Oh, I saw it. I saw it for a brief second. Uh, this down here was gonna be my wool collection area. I was gonna have, like, water streams and chests and hoppers and stuff. Making everything connect. It was gonna be great. Um, oh god. I saw it, I saw it, I saw it with my eyes. Let's see, it was... Here we go. Voila! <laughs> Very inconvenient, um, <laughs> lever. It was great. So, free by free door. Goes down here. Cool places. Would be cool if this place was finished, of course, as with all places. But yeah, I really like this area too. These were supposed to be lights, but actually there were torches under there giving the light. Uh, you could potentially, I think you could just get rid of these. Not sure if mobs could spawn here. But then you get this cool effect like this is bright here, it gets darker up on top. Uh, it gives a nice contrast, cool feel. But yeah, uh, that's about it for this build. I think it's not much to it further. Uh, but there you go. I think that's about every major build I've done on the server. I know I've done the little prank uh, to vintage beef with the with the with the little dungeon, but it's not really a big build to be honest. And uh, yeah, there's 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 already videos about that, so <laughs> go check that out. Um, but I don't think I missed any of my builds that I did on the server. Maybe there are a few minor ones. Um, I think that's about it, to be honest. Um, or, well, if, if I did miss something, my brain must have gotten some damage. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, but that's gonna be it for this little tour. Hope you guys enjoyed. Um, next season is gonna be amazing. I'm really excited for it. A lot more collabs. I want to do uh, also more collab building with people. I haven't done that really in a while. I've done that arena with BWO. Maybe he wants to do it again. Uh, we'll see. I'll talk to him. Um, but anyway, <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed. And uh, thanks for watching. And hopefully you guys aren't too sad about my 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 fails this season. But I will promise that I will do better next season. So. I hope you get. Hope you guys enjoyed again. Oh my god, I'm so bad at saying goodbyes. <laughs> you guys know that. Um, anyway, lots of cool stuff to happen next season. Uh, take care. Have a good day, and see you later. <laughs>